Roaches, leaks, and filth have people living at an Avondale apartment complex fed up tonight. Tonight, they say the landlord is not doing enough to fix the problems. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us. A few of the people living there turned to dine on your side for help. Our John Genovese spoke with the landlord tonight. He joins us live right now from the Idamont Apartments in Avondale with more. John, what are you seeing? Yeah, Craig, we're actually inside one of the apartments right now, and I want to show you some of what we've discovered. Crack open this little door, and you can see these cockroaches roaming up and down the cracks. When we got in here a few minutes ago, we turned on the lights, and they kind of scattered every direction, many of them heading in here to the kitchen. You pull back the fridge, and this is just the start of what people here say they're dealing with. I can't push my kids' bed up against the wall because roaches are climbing on it. They can't sit a cup of water down because roaches are climbing in it. Since April, roaches, roaches, roaches. Jeanette Field says she and her kids have been living with these unwelcome visitors. I pulled two roaches out my four year old's ear within a two week span. In the kids' room, this is the window. More problems, but the biggest, this is behind my refrigerator, are the small ones that move fast. I have three children. So I bomb weekly. Across the hall, Darla Reitzel spotted a roach crawling out the power socket. Last week, a bat in the living room, the same place where her four month old sleeps. I'm already breaking down dressers, throwing everything away. Inside the bathroom, the ceiling fell in again, but this isn't the first time the ceiling fell in. These pictures from the past. One time, right. a second stream of water from above. If the people upstairs take a shower or whatever, it'll run down in here. Sheila Martin seen that and more in her place down the hall. I got mold right here in, the, in this corner of my. Uh, Bathroom and mold on the side. Conditions they all say they can't live with any longer. I shouldn't have to feed my kids off of paper plates when I got dishes because I can't use my dishes because roaches on them. Now, this complex is managed by Elliott Properties. I spoke with Steve Elliott by phone tonight. He says they take issues like this extremely seriously, and the building is sprayed for roaches at least bi monthly. In many of these cases, he says the people who live here aren't calling maintenance, so they don't know the problems going on. And he says a lot of the folks we stopped, that we talked with are in the process of getting evicted. He believes they reached out to us because they're upset, but they tell me they just want this place cleaned up. For now, reporting live, John Genovese, 9 on your side.